Hello, guys. Uh, Christian? Yeah, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I kept on yeah. saying hello. I kept on saying hello. Like, what's wrong? Why can't the, these people hear me? I forgot I was on mute. Yeah. All right. Um, so we're ready to begin, Joy Deep. Have you already uh, briefed them on the sequence or uh, how this normally yes. goes or, or not yet? Yes, they are, they are trained. They're trained for two days. They are, uh, we, we did the mock call as well and practice mock call as well. Okay. Uh, if that's the case, then I'll just give you a brief, uh, just a brief description on how I would normally have this go. So first sure. of all, uh, sure. First of all, um, normally uh, this would be. Uh, I will just be giving you one uh, rebuttal per person, and then at the same, and after that, I will also be uh, going through this from the um, initial secretary script all the way down to the merchant script, um, mm -hmm. and um, what else? Uh, I will also be uh, giving you feedback either real time or uh, towards the end or both, depending on um, if it if it requires immediate attention or or or, or not or otherwise. Um, okay. For the first, how many people do we have, Joy Deep? Uh, we have seven altogether. Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay. Uh, sorry. Sorry. Not seven. Uh, uh, it's me and you minus three and six. Six altogether. One okay. more to join. Yeah, one more to join. Uh, as we carry on, she might join. Okay, cool. Uh, so I'm gonna for the first person that I that I am going to mock call. I will be guiding you. I'll give you the sequence. I'll tell you where to look for what I need you to say, and then uh -huh. um, and uh, for the other people, just please try to comprehend and follow through. Okay. 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 Good. Um, so who's gonna go first? I'm gonna go first, Andy. Go ahead. All right. Uh, ring, ring. Hello. Yeah, hi. I need to speak with the person responsible for your merchant account. And who would that be? Uh, may I ask who's calling? Uh, certainly, this is Andy. And your name is? My name is John Smith. And when, uh, what is this all about? Go to number four. Uh -huh. Sorry, we number are calling eight. About, yeah, go uh -huh. ahead. We, we are calling about your merchant account. And who would I need to speak with regarding this? Uh, that's going to be Mr. John Doe. But again, what is this all about? Uh, well, uh, we are updating our information and I need to get some verification. So I'll wait while you direct my call. Okay, very good. So I like the fact that you guys already are aware of the, of the sequence. So, so we can, uh, that's going to be good. All right, perfect. This is John Doe. Yeah, hi, Mr. Doe. This is Andy. I'm with Merchant Reviews. Uh, my company requested that I contact you personally. I appreciate you taking my call. As I'm sure you're aware about the global situation that's happening right now. Uh, therefore, we are contacting independent businesses to help reduce cost and show you exactly where on your statement you're being overcharged in an effort to help put money back into your business uh, when things get back to normal. So to determine exactly how much we can save you, I need to ask you a couple of quick questions, if you don't mind. Go ahead. Uh-huh. Just to confirm, you're indeed the one that looks after the merchant account for the business, right? That's correct, yes. Okay, and you do accept credit cards from your customers? That's correct, yes. All right. Uh, so who are you currently processing with? Uh, Monterey's Chase, Toronto Dominion? Uh, I'm currently processing with Chase. And by the way, uh, you don't have to say Toronto Dominion. TD uh -huh. is okay. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm currently processing with Chase. Uh-huh. Okay, and where... When they send you a statement, do they send it online or through the mail? Uh, they send it through email. Okay. Uh, thank you so much for sharing this information with me. Uh, I would like to connect uh, quick, you to one quick quick pause. Uh, uh -huh. Joy Deep, have you already informed them that they no longer need to read the email question? Yes, I told them, yeah. Okay, so, um, so what... Uh... Yes, I didn't ask that question, that's why. Okay. All right, very good. But I have asked them to follow the rebuttals in case the customer says, uh, oh, yeah. you know, yeah. Yes, for sure. For sure. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Okay, thank you for sharing this information with me. Uh, we would like to provide you with more details about how we, we can, uh, uh, about how you can save money on your current merchant services. We have a very competitive rates and we will offer you the lowest on the market without sacrificing the excellent service you are entitled to. So I will just connect you with one of our specialists and they can answer all your questions. Would that be all right with you? Okay. All right. Ring, ring. Hello. 
Yeah, hi, this is Andy. May I know who I'm speaking with? Um, my name is uh, John. Uh-huh. Yeah, hi, John. Uh, yeah, please take down the details. I have the customer's name as John Dove, and his contact number is 12345. He's currently processing with Chase, and he receives their statement on mail. I'm sorry, online, and would like to save money on the emergency services. Can you take it from here? Sure. All right, thank you. Uh, great, I will exit out the call now. Okay, good. Um, not a lot of problems there. I like it. You sound very conversational. You clearly know the material, which is good. Uh, so I'm good with that. Uh, we can move on to the next one. Thank you. Who will be next? Moni? Okay. Yes, sir. Hello. Hello. Go ahead. Okay. Good morning. I need to speak with a person responsible for your merchant account. And who would that be? Okay. That's a long E, not a short I. So it's speak, not speak. Can you say that again for me? Speak. Okay. It's speak. Uh, long speak. E. Very good. Okay. Speak. Like you're saying eat, right? You don't say it, right? So you say eat. eat. So, yes. so it's speak. very good. It's speak. So, yeah. So you just need to extend it instead of okay. uh, one short uh, so it should be an E. So speak. speak. Okay, so you're, you're doing it again, right? Okay. So speak. So it's okay. In, it, it's fine. Enunciate. Um, enunciate your words. It's fine. You don't have to rush. So okay. say it's okay. You don't, you don't have to be nervous. Say it with me. Speak. Speak. Okay. So speak. you're... You're doing it. You're doing it. Eat. Uh, say eat. Eat. Very good, eat. right? So you can say eat, not it, right? It's not it. Eat. So it's eat. So you say speak. Speak. Oh, Joy, did just work with her on that, okay? Okay, sure. I'll All right. That. Let's just move on. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Good morning. I need to speak. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, let's continue. It's okay. It's okay. It's fine. Um, I, I, we'll, we'll, I'll have Joy Deep work with you on that or whoever your, your TL or trainer is going to be, but, but that's something yeah. you have to work with. Short E's and, uh, short I's and long E's. Okay? Go ahead. Okay. okay sure. uh, Bonnie, take a note. Uh, Bonnie, take a note. Yeah. Go ahead. Okay. Good morning. Uh, good morning. I need to speak with the person responsible for your merchant account and who would that be? Uh, may I ask who's calling? Certainly, this is CJ, and your name is? My name is John Smith, and what is this all about? Hi, James. We are calling about your merchant account, and who would I need to speak with regarding this? I, I said my name is John. So, my, Anyway, uh, my name is John, and you need to speak with John Doe. Uh, but again, what is this all about? <clears throat> okay, sir. Can I start again? Sure, no problem. Go ahead. Okay. Good morning. Good morning. I need to speak with the person responsible for your merchant account, and who would that be? May I ask who's calling? Certainly, this is CJ. Go ahead. It's fine. CJ. Don't mind. Don't mind the chicken. Just, just. <laughs> it's fine. I'm sorry, sir. I'm nervous. It's okay. Okay, it's fine. I'm here. Okay. Tell you what. Let's skip you. Um, and uh, we'll do you probably last or later on, uh, but because I don't want to, um, I, I understand you're nervous, but I don't want to waste my, my time and your time as well uh, because okay. I have other things to do. Uh, so let's just skip you for now and then uh, we can okay. move on to the next one and then uh, we'll just do you last, okay? Okay. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's uh, we'll move on to the next one. Yeah, Rick. Unmute your uh, unmute yourself first, Rick. Rick. Hello. Yeah, go yeah. ahead. Hello. Hello, go ahead, guys. Yeah, go ahead. I'm listening. Can you hear me? 
Yeah, I, I'm listening. Go ahead. Okay. Okay. Do I stop? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, ring, ring. Hello. Good morning. I need to speak with the person responsible for your merchant account. And who would that be? May I ask who's calling? Certainly. This is Rick, and your name is? My name is John Smith, and what is this all about? Hello, John, and uh, we're calling about your merchant account. Okay. We are updating our information, and I need to get some verification. And I will wait while you direct my call. Thank you. Okay, so you don't even know who you are to be transferred to yet, right? So be careful with that because, uh, uh, yeah, for that one, you don't, again, you don't know who you're going to be transferred to. So uh, make sure to um, get a response for who you need to speak with regarding uh, issues with uh, merchant account, okay? Right. Actually, I was waiting for the response, so I thought... That's yeah. okay. Uh, okay. But... but, but also understand that your the the customers might not respond the way you expect them to, right? So just make sure that okay. you're prepared. Okay, let's just move on. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. Um, let's start from the top and let's see if we can make it smoother. Okay, I'll start from the beginning then. Yeah. Good morning. I need to speak with the person responsible for your merchant account, and who would that be? May I ask who's calling? Certainly. This is Rick, and your name is. My name is John, and what is this all about? Well, uh, John, who would I need to speak with regarding this? We are calling about your merchant account, and who would I need to speak with regarding this? Um, that's going to be Mr. John Doe. But again, what is this all about? Well, uh, we are updating our information, and I need to get some verification. And I'll wait while you direct my call. Thank you. Okay, this is, uh, this is John Doe. Hello, this is Rick with Merchant Reviews, and uh, my company requested that I contact you personally, and I appreciate you taking my call. Due to the global situation, uh, we are contacting businesses to help reduce your rates and fees by 25 to 40 percent. Our goal is to help uh, put money back into your business to use when things return to normal. So to determine exactly how much we can save you, I need to ask you just a couple of quick questions, if you don't mind. Go ahead. Just to confirm, you are indeed the one that looks after the merchant account for the business? That's correct, yes. Okay. And your business is active, and you do accept credit cards from your customers. Is that correct? That's correct, yes. Perfect. And what is your title or position with the company? Um, I'm the business owner. Uh -huh. And who are you currently processing with? Uh, example, uh, Chase, TD, or Moneris? I'm currently processing with Chase. Perfect. And when they send you your statement, uh, do they send it online or through the mail? Uh, they send it through email. Uh -huh. Thank you very much for sharing the information with me. I'd like to connect you to one of our rate specialists uh, who have the ability to eliminate 40% of your rates and fees. Would that be alright with you? Sure. Great. But you know what? Just um, online while I yeah. Uh, uh, for now, just email me your rates. Okay. Well, uh, I'll be happy to do that. Unfortunately, I'm not trying to give you rates. Uh, it would actually be one of my brokers who has the ability to reduce your charges by twenty-five to forty percent per month. All you'd like to do today, however, is connect you with my rate specialist to make sure that you are not being overcharged. This would be a great time, you know, to do this before business picks up. Just think about it. How important would it be to you if you can reduce your cost to 25 to 40 percent? Mm, sounds pretty good. Mm -hmm. So please be online while I just go ahead and uh, get your call connected. Okay. Ring, ring. Hello. Hello, uh, this is Rick. Hello, this is Rick from Center 2. May I know whom I'm speaking with? Uh, this is Dylan. 
Hi, Dylan. Uh, and I have uh, Miss John on the line uh, with contact number 1234 and currently uses Chase and he receives their states, uh, statements online and would like to save money on their merchant services. Can you take it from here, please? Sure. Great. I'll exit off the call now. Thank you very much. Okay. All right. Good. Um, so that was pretty good. It was pretty smooth, and I can sound your uh, your that you have a, you know a very fairly good ability to to um what do you call this uh to sound conversational, which is really good. I like it. <clears throat> um, what I need right. you to work on is. Uh, one is your acknowledgement statement uh, because when I told you that I agree with you that you can transfer me over, I didn't hear, you know, any words of um, agreement or acknowledgement that you know you're happy that I agreed with you. And you know, it is a happy occasion if okay. our customers agree. I could have said great at least. Yeah, great, right. perfect, awesome, wonderful. Right. Power words, really. So right, just right. just work on those. Um, okay. Transition statements between questions and also between rebuttals is also uh, is also a plus. So that's it. Okay. All right. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. We can now proceed on to the next one. Hello. Hello. Should I start? Yeah, go ahead. A ring ring. Yeah, go ahead. Good morning. Uh, I need to speak with the person responsible for your merchant account. And who would that be? May I ask who's calling? Certainly, this is Bella. And your name is? My name is John uh, Smith. And what is this all about? OK, uh, we are calling about your merchant account. And uh, who do I need to speak with regarding this? Um, that's going to be Mr. John Dobrigwin. What is this all about? Okay. Uh, we are updating our information and I need to get some verification. And I'll wait while you take my call. Thank you. Okay. This is John, uh, John Doe. Hello, John Doe. This is Bella with Merchant Review. Uh, my company requested that I contact you personally. I appreciate you taking my call. Uh, as I'm sure you are aware of the global situation that's happening right now, Therefore, we are contacting independent businesses to help reduce cost and show you exactly where on your statement you are being overtures in an effort to help put money back into your business uh, when things get back to normal. So to determine exactly how much we can save you, I need to ask you just a couple of quick questions, if you don't mind. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, just to confirm, uh, you are indeed the one that looks after the merchant account for the business? That's correct. Okay. Uh, you do accept credit cards from your customers, correct? Mm, that's correct. Great. Uh, who are you currently processing with, like Monaris, Chase, TD? I'm currently processing with Chase. Chase, right? Okay. Uh, when they send you your merchant statement to you, do they send it to you, you online or through the mail? Uh, they send it through email, but I'm very happy with their services. Great. Uh, whatever it is you are currently processing, uh, we guarantee that we can show you a savings of up to 40% by simply assessing your current rates, including any potential hidden rates. Uh, we will be able to tell you exactly where your current processing company is overcharging you and show you where those hidden costs are on your bill. Uh, more importantly, we will show how much savings you can get on a monthly and annual basis. Uh, this is money that will go back right back into your business. Okay. Um, okay. okay. Okay, uh, so as I, I was asking you, uh, when they send you uh, your merchant statement to you, do they send it to you online or through the mail? Uh, they send it through email. Okay, thank you. Uh, thank you for sharing this information with me. Uh, I'd like to connect you to one of our rate specialists who has the ability to eliminate 40% of your rates and fees. Would that be all right with you? Mm, that's okay. Perfect. Uh, Please hold on while I'm connecting you. Go ahead. Ring, ring. Hello. Hello, this is Bella from center number two. May I know who I'm speaking with? This is uh, Dylan. 
Hello, Dylan. Uh, I have a John Smith on the line with contact number 123. Currently uses Chase processor and he receives their statement by online and would like to save money on your merchant services. Can you take it from here? Sure. Okay, I'll exit the call now. Thank you. Okay, very good. Um, pretty smooth, pretty standard. I like it. You're able to find the rebuttal that I need. Um, but uh, what I want you to do, uh, and this goes for everyone as well, uh, I want you to replace great with I understand. Okay. So that rebuttal of yours that you gave, I want you to replace great with I understand. Okay. Sure. Okay. Great. Let's proceed on to the next one. Guys, hello, ring ring. Hello, good morning. I need to speak with the person responsible for your merchant account, and who would that be? Uh, may I ask who's calling? Certainly, this is Robert, and your name is my name is John Smith. And what is this all about? We are calling about your merchant account, and who would I need to speak regarding this? Um. That's going to be Mr. John Doe, but again, what is this all about? We are updating our information, and I need to get some verification, and I'll wait while you direct my call. Thanks. Okay. Hello? Hello, this is Robert with Merchant Review, and you are? Dylan. Okay, Mr. Dylan, my company requested that I contact you personally. I appreciate you taking my call. As I'm sure you are aware about the global situation that's happening right now, therefore, we are contacting independent businesses to help reduce costs and show you exactly where on your statements you are being overcharged in an effort to help put money back into your business when things get back to normal. To determine exactly how much we can save you, I need to ask you just a couple of quick questions if you don't mind. Mm -hmm. Just to confirm, you are indeed the one that looks after the merchant account for the business, right? That's correct, yes. What is your title or the position with the company? Um, I'm the business owner. Okay. You do accept credit cards from your customers, correct? That's correct. Terrific. Who are you currently processing with? Like Monris, Chase, huh. TD? Huh? Mm, I'm currently processing with Chase. Okay. When they send you merchant statements to you, do they send it to you online or through the mail? Online. Thank you for sharing this information with me. I would like to connect you to one of our rate specialists who has the ability to eliminate 40% of your rates and fees. Would that be all right with you, sir? Um, sure, that's, that's fine. Okay, um, please but, hold on. The but you know what? Uh, before you do that, uh, what I want you to do is I want you to... Um, uh, what I want you to do is just tell okay. me what your rates are. Tell me your rates. Unfortunately, I'm not qualified to give you rates. It would actually be one of my brokers who has the ability to reduce your charges by 25 to 40% per month. All we would like you to do today is connect you with my rate specialist to make sure that you are not being overcharged. This would be a great time to do this before businesses picks up. How important would it be to you if you can reduce your cost 35 to 40 percent, isn't it? Um, sure, I guess. All right. So please hold on the line while I connect you to one of our red specialists, okay? Go ahead. Perfect. Ring, ring. Hello. 
Hello, this is Robert and I have Mr. Smith on the line with contact number 123, currently using Chase and he receives his statements by mail and would like to save money on their merchant services. Can you take it from here? Sure. All right, I will exit off the call now. Thank you. Okay. Um, I'm glad you were able to find and deliver the rebuttal immediately, but what I really am concerned about that call is that um, it's very monotonous. It's very, very flat. So that's what I'm concerned of. I don't, I don't want it to, to sound like that because it's clear that you are reading and it, it's, it, it doesn't sound good, to be honest. It doesn't sound good that it, you're, you're clearly reading from a script. Uh, I'm sure that eventually and essentially you will be able to improve that. But, but for now, I need you to practice on uh, mastery and familiarity, okay? Okay. 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 Let's move on to the next one. Go ahead. Hi. Go ahead. Okay. Ring, ring. Go ahead. Good morning. I need to speak with the person responsible for a merchant account, and who would that be? May I ask who's calling? Certainly. This is Shanti, and your name is? Uh, my name is John Smith, and what is this all about? We are calling about your merchant account, and I would need to speak. I would need to speak with. We are calling about your merchant account, and who would I need to speak with regarding this? Um, that's going to be Mr. John Dobe again. What is this all about? We are updating um, our information and I need to get some verification and I'll wait for you direct my call. Thanks. Okay. This is John Doe. Hello, this is Shanti with Mansion Review. My company requested that I contact you personally. I appreciate you taking my call. As I'm sure you're aware about the global situation that's happening right now. Therefore, we are contacting independent businesses to help reduce costs and show you where exactly on your statement you're being overcharged in an effort to help put money back into your business when things get back to normal. To determine exactly how, how much we can save you, I need to ask you just a couple of Indeed, the Go one ahead. that looks after the account for the business. Mm, that's correct. You do accept credit cards from your customers, mm, correct? Correct. Great. Who are you currently processing with? Examples, Manuris, Chess, TD? I'm currently processing with Chase. Okay. When they send your mention statement to you, do they send it to you online or through the mail? Uh, they send it through email. So that I can add more information in your hands, what is your email? It's 123 at gmail.com. Okay. Thank you for sharing this information with me. I would like to connect you to one of our red specialists who has the ability to eliminate 40% of your reds and fees. Would that be all right with you? Mm, that's fine. But uh, to be honest with you, I'm not really interested. I appreciate you letting me know that. And due to the recent reduction on rates, I am sure you have been getting a lot of calls about your processing in general. We're not looking to have you do anything today. However, if one of your red, our red specialists can show you savings of 25 to 40% of your monthly bill, that would be something you would at least take a look at, right? Mm, that's correct, yes. Okay. Thank you. Why don't I... I'm sorry. Before I connect, okay. Uh, 
Hello. Hello. This is Shanti and I have John on the line with the contact number 123 uses chess and he receives their statements on online mm -hmm. and would like to save money on their mentioned on their mentioned services. Can you take it from me? I'll exit off the call now. Thank you. Okay. Um so that uh, that will, that call uh I mean, you were able to say the right words and all that, but it was pretty flat. I mean, I couldn't, uh, and what I mean by that is I couldn't really hear anything uh, that is that you you weren't reading. Is what I'm trying to say. Everything everything that I heard was was practically read. So, so that's that's the, that's an issue. That's an issue that we have to take care of because um, uh, it. It, you, I'm okay with you reading it. That's not an issue. What I'm I'm concerned about is that you're reading it, but you you you're you sound like you're reading it. You definitely sound like you are reading it. So, um, and that will come off uh, from your customer's point of view. It will come off as you not knowing what you're doing because you're just reading off of the script. And I don't want that to happen. Okay. Okay, sir. All right. Well, what was your name again? Shanti. Shanti. Okay. Very good. Yes. All right. Um, this is she's the last one, right? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Good morning. I need to speak with the person responsible for your merchant account, and who would that be? Uh, that would be Miss. Uh, actually, you know what? Um, may I ask who's calling? Certainly, this is CJ, and your name is. My name is John Smith, and what is this all about? Hi, John. We are calling about your merchant account, and we are updating our information, and I need, and I need to get some verification, then I'll wait while you direct my call. Thanks. Okay. So, a uh, quick pause. So, you're skipping steps. Uh, you're not... You're not giving. You're not asking. You're not confirming the name of the... Um, you're not confirming the name of the person that you need to be speaking with, right? I'm sorry. So you're not confirming the name of the person that you need to speak with, and that's a that's a problem. You all you're doing is asking the the secretary to transfer you over, and that's okay. all well and good. But you don't even know uh, who you need to be transferred to, which is obviously a problem. So that's that's what we need to figure out first. We need to know who it is that you need to be speaking with. Do you understand? Yes. Okay. All right. Um, okay. So if that's the case, then you know what? Give me give me your lines, and then we'll see where we go from there. Go ahead. It's okay. Hello. Oh, we lost the connection. Um, uh, we lost her. When she 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 might be joining. Can give me give me a second. Just give me some time. Okay. Sorry for the sound. Connection issue, please. Just. Uh, it's okay. If in case, uh, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, if yeah. in case uh, she's uh, since she's not yet back, um, let's mm. just uh, let's just wait and uh, let's we can just do her some other time because uh, okay. uh, yeah, I still have other things to do as well. Sure. Um, so let's sure. just wait until uh, until she's back, uh, or maybe if it's if it's not gonna be today. 
and maybe it's going to be by uh, Monday or whatever, whenever. Um, uh, anyway, uh, Joydeep, I'm going to be uh, online up until 6 anyway, so just, just uh, message me, okay? Sure, I'll do that. If she's back, I'll give a, I'll give a ping. Yeah. Okay, cool. Okay, sure. Thank you. Thank you, Christian. No, oh, well, you're welcome. Okay. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Bye, guys. Bye-bye.